right, guys, welcome back to Vision Nightclub Online. Tonight we're sitting down backstage with Kenneth Thomas. You're very well known for your work with Paul Oakenfold. How did you start working with Oki, and, uh, and how has it influenced your productions? Uh, I started working with Oki um, when I started producing. Um, you know, I had done a lot of local opening support for him and his shows uh, back in like 2001, 2002 in Detroit. Uh, me and Elevation worked for a year. We had a couple, you know, decent buzz progressive trance records that came out. And um, Paul was really, really big on those records, like huge on those records. And then when he came back to Detroit, uh, I was reintroduced to him as like, hey, this is the guy behind these records. And he, he just really, you know, he really clicked and he was really big on, on the stuff I was doing and the sound I was doing, the melodic, but still like chunky dance floor driven stuff. Your tracks, uh, Driving Firefly, have gotten a lot of attention this year. Um, What's your favorite song or collaboration that you've done? Uh, I would say um, <clears throat> they, they all kind of have their, their special place, but I think my all-time favorite record that I've ever done is Drive. And Drive, it's because I just, it's, the, the vocals came to me, were sent to me, and I pretty much wrote all the melodies and harmonies around the vocals from start to finish. And still to this day, I, I'm just, it's still melodically, harmonically, musically my favorite you know, production, and, and I think that it's the you know closest um, to an absolute representation of what I'm about. Also, Ghost in the Machine, which is my first big trance hit for sentimental reasons, uh, and then uh, and then I would say Firefly is my favorite remix, just because that that vocal also is just amazing. <laughs> DJing or producing, uh, what are some of your other interests? I don't know. I mean, to be honest, it's like this industry is like, you know, to, to be successful, it's all or nothing. So you really don't have a ton of other interests. I mean, I just kind of hang out with friends and, you know, when I get a night off, just kind of chill out and maybe just, you know, go to the pub and hang out for a little bit. Um, but yeah, not, not a whole lot of interest. Once in a while, I sneak away and play poker. Uh, baseball. Actually, I'm, I'm a huge Detroit Tigers fan, huge baseball fan right now. Um, I usually catch about 15, 20 games a year. You know, so that's kind of during the summer, that's my, you know, that's my kind of poison. I'm always sneaking out of the studio to catch a game. And, um, but really, it's, it, it, to make it in this industry and to be successful, it's, it really is, for most people, all or nothing. It's, you know, right now, this is my life, and I, and I love it. So what do you have next for your fans? Uh, let's see. Well, I mean, just touring a ton. Um, I've got a lot of projects uh, in the mix, a lot of new tracks. I, I did start a label about a year and a half ago called Myth Records, and it, the focus of that was more underground progressive. We did have to pause the label, and, but we are going to relaunch under a new brand. It's called I Am Phoenix, and that direction is going to be a little bit more big room. The first release is going to be uh, my track Piece of Me. It's a collaboration with The Madison out of Russia who works um, with Enhanced a lot. Really just putting one foot in front of the other and, and you know keep the podcast obsessions going. We're back to weekly on that now, which is, which is great. I know a lot of my fans are really excited that we're back to weekly format with that. And you know just hopefully reaching as many people as we can. Just keep putting, you know, pushing the sound out and you know, taking it day by day and just enjoying every moment. Oh, thanks for sitting down, man. Thanks for having me, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, looking forward to hearing the set. Me so. too, man. I love Vision, and I'm, I'm really excited to, to finally be back here. Yeah. Well, uh, on behalf of Kenneth and uh, the Vision crew, we hope you guys enjoy the show. Yeah. 